From down trees to massive waves at local beaches. People in the coastal areas are also on high alert this morning. KCAL News reporter Tina Patel is live in Redondo Beach where the pier has now been closed off as a precaution. Tina. with you guys about a half an hour ago and I was telling you that we were seeing all the debris on the roads as we were driving. I still was not prepared for exactly how windy it is here on the coast. I'll step out of the way. It's still dark, but I feel like you can tell that the surf is really pounding this morning and that is why the police department has closed the pier. Take a look at this video. They did that last night because of both the high wind and the high surf. They just didn't want to have people in this area and then have to worry about people trying to get too close. So I will say that even though it is early in the morning, we're Normally we see some people starting to get an early walk or run. We've only seen one person out here with their dog. I think that when you kind of walk out and you actually feel how strong these winds are, people are just uh, turning around and heading back inside and telling their dog we're going to have to deal with that later. Now we are hearing about a few problems. As we said, uh, there, there are some trees in the South Bay that have already come down because of these winds. We've also heard some reports of, of the water, the surf actually going over some break walls. So again, we are going to be having these winds throughout the day. They are already here. If you don't need to kind of be by the water, best to not be here. We saw earlier this when we were pulling up, there was some beach and harbor patrol folks that were already putting sandbags here by the sand because uh, Chris and Marcy, as much as we're seeing the high surf now, high tide isn't actually for a few more hours. So that's why the police said that the pier would be closed at least till 8 a.m. We'll see if they extend that because of the high tide coming a little bit later in this morning. But again, uh, just be careful as you're heading out the door. You're definitely going to feel how cold it is and you probably also want to take a little extra time on the roads because of these winds. We'll send it back to you. Okay, Tina, thank you so much for that update.